You know, some of y'all just won't let shit go, man. I tell you. I was on um, the internet earlier, and I read that Michael Vick was supposed to have a book signed. You know, uh, he had wrote a book, you know, I guess. You know, his story is pretty marketable, you know. Um, the whole dog incident, him going to jail for it, for the dog fighting, and, you know, trying to come back into the NFL and be successful, and blah, blah, blah. But, um... Before he got to the book signing, he was, you know, some of his people that worked with him was receiving death threats saying they were going to slice his throat, you know, for the whole dog incident and, you know, saying he was going to kill him and et cetera, et cetera. Now, what irritates me about this story is that why won't y'all let this shit go? The brother did his time, okay, came out. Did what he was had to do, you know, apologize to the press and all that shit. Let it go. Now, there's no secret that white people love animals, you know. I, yeah, I'm not, you know, I mean, I'm not, you know, trying to talk about white people like that. But y'all have a tendency, y'all love animals and shit a little bit more than everybody else. Black people, Hispanic, we, we like them too. But we don't like them like y'all, you know. We, we're not going to, you know, forsake our bills or our rent. To feed some damn dog, you know. I'm just, I'm keeping it real, you know. But white people, they, they take you out over an animal, and you, know, it seems like they, people just won't let this brother go on with his life and live because of that dog fighting shit. You got people out here that are having sex with little kids. You have innocent people getting shot down. And I don't see anybody sending death threats to them saying, oh, yeah, we're going to come after you. You touched that little girl, that little boy. Or, or you, you shot that innocent person over there. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm coming to kill you. You don't do that for them. But you go after a brother for a damn dog fight. I, and I'm going to say brother because I noticed that this is very potent with black African Americans, males. And, you know, we can look at it from, uh, you know, Chris Brown's point of view. Y'all won't let him go. You know, that shit happened, what, in 2009. You still got people antagonizing them, picking on them, you know, uh, uh, trying to start little little beefs with them and stuff to pro pro uh, provoke them so he can do something back to you. It's like, you know, when, 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 a, when a black male makes a mistake, you pay for it for the rest of your life. You know, you got people who... Chopped up people, you know, uh, you know, ate somebody ass out, you know, killed a whole bunch of kids, and they don't get the same ridicule as, as some of these brothers do for little simple stuff. Let people move on. If y'all don't go after, you know, these pedophiles out here and people in the community that that's that shooting down innocent people. I just read earlier that uh, a six month year old got gunned down. Six months. Baby was in intensive care, died today. And, and, and the father got shot too. I think he was changing, you know, if, I, if I'm not mistaken, he was, you know, changing his daughter's diaper or whatever. Some joker came up and just started shooting. But, you know, we don't get no death threats for that. That's, that, that's cool. But Michael Vick, Chris Brown, Michael Jackson, any of these people who you make a mistake in their life, and they try to come out, move on with their life. They pay their debt to society. People continue to keep fucking with them. And you know, I don't, I don't get it. You know, I know the system we live in, but it's like y'all gotta let some of this go, man. You know, you gotta move on. Stop holding on to old bullshit, other stuff that we could be focusing on. But that's all I gotta say. You know, let this brother back in the game. Stop picking on. Black males that make mistakes that that are that in the entertainment business, you know, they're human just like everybody else. They eat shit and sleep just like you. You listening to this this video here and anybody else, they eat, sleep, and shit just like you. They're human. We all make mistakes. If you pay your debt to society, you come out, you do what you gotta do, move on with your life. But that's all I gotta say. I'm out.